Cervical cancer, the third most common cancer in the world. Every year, 570,000 people get this cancer. 310,000 people die because of this cancer. 1970, there was a German doctor, Harold Zuhausen. He made a theory, HPV causes cervical cancer. But at that time, a lot of people said, no, it's not possible. That is too common virus. Harold didn't respond them. He was trying to research for the people who has a cancer. But there was no proof that HPV develops a cancer by transforming a normal cell. He had to find a perfect HPV gene in cancer. So, what is HPV? Human papillome virus. There are more than 200 different types of HPV, each identified with a number. Most of them are not threatening, but HPV 16 and 18 are high-risk types known to significantly increase the risk of cancer. 70% of cervical cancer had HPV 16 and 18. 1983, he found a perfect HPV gene. His theory has been proved. 1994, International Agency for Research on Cancer. We give an admission, he's right. So, they made a vaccine and it has more than 90% prevention rate. 28. Nobel Foundation We acknowledge Harold's contribution to discovering the cause of cervical cancer through persistence research, overcoming the conventional wisdom of the world. We present him the Nobel Prize in Psychology or Medicine. He got the Nobel Prize. 2017, National Institutes of Health found that HPV can cause anal cancer, pineal cancer, testicular cancer, prostate cancer. Since then, men without uterus have also been vaccinated to prevent cancer caused by HPV. In 2021, a lot of organizations including Doctor Without Borders, they provide free vaccinations to girl aged 9 to 13 in 91 countries. We are stopping cervical cancer. And I think we can stop lung cancer, liver cancer, colorectal cancer too. And I'm sure that one day we can live cancer free world. I'm David. I make 3 minutes video every day. Let's do it together.